So welcome back everyone. I am so excited about bringing on my next guest who is Peter Rona and he owns abcdmedicare.com. I want you to tell everyone a little bit about you. I'm going to talk about you too, but I'm going to let you go first, okay? Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater. Hey, I'm back on the radio with Carol. Um, I'm a licensed insurance agent, owner of uh, abcdmedicare.com, a local agency in the Phoenix market. Uh, it's really a broker for all types of plans of Medicare supplements, Medicare Advantage plans, prescription drug plans. We do individual family plans, the Affordable Care Act plans, or Obamacare plans. I wow. haven't heard that name in a while, right? I know. And um, so, yeah, so we do all those plans and help people um, plan for their, their healthy lives. Here's the other thing about Peter. I want to, first of all, talk about how you are a uh, senior advocate. Number one. Number one. Totally. You are. And uh, the other thing about Peter is he, I love to talk about this because when we brought this up, it's all, it makes you stand out as much as everything else about you that does, <laughs> but this really does make you stand out a lot, which is that you speak three languages, okay? Yep. Tell them what it is. Uh, the first language is uh, English, hablamos en español, Spanish, right? And then the other one, I speak Medicare, which is uh, absolutely a totally different language uh, when you're turning 65, or even when you're 65, you still don't understand all the A, B, C, Ds of Medicare. That's what we're for. They actually do that on purpose, I think. I mean, they've made it so difficult. I think the goal is by the time I turn 65 to have all the letters in play. Wow. We're going to have plan Z pretty soon. I bet you. I bet you. <laughs> now, okay, it's a, it's a special time right now. Let's explain what the, what's the time right now for everyone. So we're kind of like a pre-annual enrollment period, which is AEP, which is with, before October 15th. Uh, you have until October 15th, from October 15th until December 7th, to change your Medicare plan. Uh, you, most, most likely it's going to be your prescription drug plan, or it's going to be your Medicare Advantage plan, HMO, PPO type plans. But right now, this month, it's um, when everybody who's either on a prescription drug plan and a Medicare Advantage plan will be receiving what we call their ANOC, the A-N-O-C. And that stands for the annual notice of change. So we are going to start with something uh, mm -hmm. that we wanted to do. It's, we're going to have a little fun here today. Yeah. Knock, knock. Who's there? A knock. A knock who? I don't know the answer. It's the Medicare annual notice of change. And this, this time period is, is going to be extremely important this year. Usually there's plan changes every year. Every plan changes, whether it's a copay or hospital cost or maybe the formulary changes in terms of the drugs and where they're covered to one or two. Right now, this year is going to be the most disruptive year for people on Medicare. For Why 2025. That? Really? There are a lot of pressures coming down from CMS, which is the uh, official office for the Medicare.gov, you know, all the, all the things that we What government. kind of pressures do they want to put on um, the seniors? Cost. That's pressure. Cost, um, inflation, um, the cost of drugs. And so there's a lot of changes going on. There's going to be a lot of disruptions happening. And this ANOC that we were, were kind of having some fun with, the Knock Knock ANOC, which is the website we want to talk about, knockknockanoc.com, um, is going to tell the, the beneficiary, the person who's on Medicare, what changes are coming. Traditionally, they estimated about 10% of the population changes every, maybe a little more, maybe 15% changes from one plan to another. There are going to be so much pressure on, uh, on insurance companies um, due to cost to change the benefits. Some of them are going to be better, some of them are going to be for the worse. That you have to read your ENOC this year. You just can't assume, oh, it's not going to be that much. It's going to be drastic. It's going to be a lot of changes happening. Wow. They're expecting now about 30 to 35, maybe 40% of the population who's on Medicare is going to want to change their plan. I'm telling you now, when you are listening to this, what I love about my show the most is the information that people get. Right. And right now, there's a lot of seniors. Obviously, we have a lot of them that do happen to listen to the show, too. Right. You have to, this is something this year that you are going to be really, I mean. So this is, this year is the probably the first year of, of dramatic changes. So 25 is going to be the first sequence of the next three years where changes are going to be coming, and they're going to be coming in phases. So 2025 is going to be the first phase, 2026 is going to be the second phase, and then I believe 2027 is going to be the third phase. And they're really what they're doing, what's happening, is they're going to right-size Medicare. There, there was a, a coming out of COVID, I'll have to explain why. I didn't know it was the wrong size. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, there was a lot of rich benefits 
uh, in plans. There's a, there's been since COVID. So when COVID happened, nobody wants to talk about COVID more like, hey, that's behind us. Mm -hmm. But we're still feeling those effects, meaning that when COVID happened, people weren't getting things done. They weren't going to the doctor. They didn't go to the specialist. They didn't have surgeries done. They didn't have knee replacements. They didn't have heart surgeries unless it was absolutely necessary, right? So there was an underutilization of, of people weren't getting things done. Doctors' offices were about to close because they weren't seeing patients, mm -hmm. right? Um, a lot of private practice doctors, primary care doctors, sold their practices. So now there's a shortage of doctors, right? Um, and so what's happening now on the rebound of COVID, things have opened up. People are back to life, living normal. And they, in that rebound, there's been an overutilization. People have now have used more than what was expected and mm -hmm. has cost the plan more money at a higher rate because of inflation. Of course. Right? And right. so now these plants are, are, are having to account for that. So that's one of the pressures. We, we, we didn't estimate that we were going to have to pay that amount of money to cover. Well, right? I'll tell you what, the best thing for people to do is to have a consultation with someone like you. Absolutely. Uh, because, you know, first of all, if you, where else but on Networking Arizona would you hear about all of this? And I know that it doesn't sound like good news, but the good news is you have someone like Peter to be able to explain to you, right, and but to then find, because you're going to change your plan most likely, it sounds like. Uh, uh, again, I think conservative estimate is 30%. I mean, I was, I've been in meetings probably the last three weeks with insurance companies, rooms, room full of agents, experts. Some of the people are, are experts, probably more knowledgeable than me and some of the carriers, right? Just as expert people and you're listening to them and you're learning, we're learning what's going on, how it's gonna impact the people, our, our customers, potential new customers. There's some people estimating 50, 60% change may wow. happen, right? Mm -hmm. um, there's there's gonna be plan um, consolidation, meaning that some plans are gonna be eliminated. We, we can't afford to have that plan in around, so we're gonna get rid of the plan and if you don't, and that's going to force you to change to some other plan, right? right. So there's going to be forced change. There's going to be uh, changes due to formularies. There's going to be changes due to. Um, You're going to be super busy. Absolutely, it's going to be crazy. So it's a, it's it's a it's a it's a great time for me because I'm hopefully going to help a lot of people. Yeah. But a lot of people are going to need help. But here's the thing: the best thing to do is start that conversation now, early. Because if you that way you can start at least figure out where you're at, right? right? Mm -hmm. You can help them, right. and uh, the phone number to call them and write this number down at 602-770-9062. You can either go to knockknockanock.com. Right? Yeah, that, yeah, that page okay. that page is going to give you information as to why it's important to read your ANOC, right? You, you can call me. You can go there and it's going to give you information. It's going to just say what 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 changes can you expect? Why is it such an important document? I created that page specifically after I found out the wow, what's going to happen? And I said, wow, I have to get information out to people. So I created this page, and and I linked it to my abcdmedicare.com page. It had, it's a standalone page as well. You can go to the knock knock a knock, and that came out of a conversation like, hey, knock knock, who's there? Medicare's knocking on your door, right? Yeah. They're going to come knocking. Now on your they door. really are. Yeah. And and so you need to pay attention. It's going to come to your your postal mailbox, right? Um, the other thing that's cool, and I, I just started this feature on my website, you can actually book a meeting with me on my website, so you don't have to call me. Um, it'd be nice, it, when, when you do book it, I'll get a notification, and, and I'll, I'll probably reach out to you and say, hey, how's it going, I saw you booked, that time's probably not going to work, just for so many moving targets, moving times, and maybe we adjust, but um, that starts the conversation, that starts the fact that I want to meet with you and do that stuff, so just because right now, I'm already being inundated with my current customers through this AMOC, sure. communicating with them. Um, and there's this, this, hey, I just want to make sure I'm on the right plan. Do I need to change? What's going on? Are my prescriptions covered? What are my, what's going on with my doctors? Things like that. Um, and so it's just going to be a big disruption. And, and um, you know, we're, we're bracing to help as many people as we can. And if I remember correctly, the best thing really to do is to go up onto either one of his websites. Because, and we're going to talk when we get back a little bit about why you did this. And I know why you did. Because let me tell you, folks, he loves educating people. That is what he does right. big time. It's knock, knock, a knock. Dot com, or you can go to the other one. They're both intertwined. Yep. Uh, it's abcdmedicare.com, and you can go up there and you can book an appointment right off the website. Again, abcdmedicare.com or knockknockanock.com. We're still going here live, okay? okay. And do you want to go check and see if I'll she's there? Check. Thank you. Um, oh, 
so that's why I want to come back and talk about your education and all mm -hmm. of that stuff. Um, you're still on Facebook, and not oh. as much, or is it more on Instagram now? What do you want? I do both. both. I, do, and I can't tell that I post on Instagram, and it automatically posts on Facebook. Okay, okay. I have a, a service. I up. still see you all the time. Yeah. I, I try to post as much as possible. Yeah. But, you know, that goes. Yeah, no, no, I know, I know. I can't believe that uh, those changes are coming. It's almost scary. Yeah, well, we'll talk about a positive change, right? We'll talk about one of the positive changes that's happening um, to the consumer. Uh, it's positive in one way, and, it, and it's going to affect them negatively in another way. So it's mm -hmm. kind of like, hey, But great. it sounds like everyone has really got to have a, a, a review. Yeah. Right? I it don't should. know what you call it. Yeah, a, a review. Mm -hmm. It's a Medicare, call it a Medicare review or a Medicare assessment. Yeah. You know, You're um, excited? Yeah, busy. I, I'm already. I can already feel the uptake. Uptake. Really? I, just with my current customers. Hey, I got this letter from you. I, I want to set time, and those people are just. I said, just go to my website, click on it, schedule a time. Yeah. You know, or because I I realize that on your phone, people you don't want them to do that, I right? I don't like listening to my voicemail. Okay. So should I just not yeah, put that out? Yeah, put them there. Because okay. people want to text me. Yeah. I, okay. I ask people to text me. Oh, I'll say that text. Yeah. It's just because <laughs> because people leave a voicemail, it's just so time-consuming. If yeah, you get yeah. 30 phone calls a day, you're on the phone all the time. Yeah, 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 I can understand. 90 seconds, guys. And we're okay on that side, right, online? Yeah, yeah, you had it when you, I thought you were going to start it when you put it back. But it I started, start right once away. I came in, okay. I started it. I think this one did, too. Had a good one. If we have to, we'll upload the, the, the KFNX one to it later, to, to okay. the Facebook, but we'll see how much we got. It doesn't matter, it's still up there right now. Um, so lots of different things going on. It's almost, uh, it's exciting for you because I think it's going to help you be, I mean, being busy is going to be like yeah. no tomorrow. I've always been busy. No, but I mean, I think <laughs> yeah. this is going to be. This is going to be a new level of business. Yeah, yeah. And people are going to have to understand, and I think that's another we're, thing that we're I want to. We're doing events as well. You are still doing yeah. events? Okay, doing some good. events we can talk about. Okay, if we get to it. Okay, hold on tight. I put you on twice today. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter. We can fix that. We have to fix that out to 2023, so we'll do a new one. They won't remember. So welcome back, everyone. We are talking with uh, Peter Arona, the owner of ABCDMedicare.com. Listen up, folks. Uh, whether it's you or someone that you know, uh, so, literally, Medicare is season is upon us. Yeah. And uh, you know, there's a lot of changes. You were mentioning that before. I will like to say, first of all, if you're looking for a seniors advocate, Peter is definitely the person to talk to. If you want to get educated. Peter's the one to talk to about that too. I love your Facebook posts and all of that that you do, and um, the way that you take some of the stuff that you do here at the radio right. and you yeah. intertwine it. It's really cool. Instagram as well. I also want to say for anyone, he's saying you got to read your ANOC this year. You got to read it when it comes in. Also, please, I don't know why I looked out the window, but for right, you also please anyone who uh, doesn't speak uh, English, if you speak Spanish, have them speak with you because that's something that everybody loves to be able to talk with in, and to understand it in their native tongue. Yeah, I mean, that, here's the other thing that's important. Um, today, you know, you think about the Medicare beneficiary. It could be someone under 65 because they have a disability and they're on Medicare. Could be someone who's 65, uh, maybe 70 years old, 80 years old. Um, the reality is this: um, family culture is important, right? And a lot of times, the parents just let the plan roll over and they don't do anything. So it's important if you if you're listening, you have a mom or a dad or an aunt, an uncle, someone you care about is on Medicare, and you're an influencer in their life. You influence in their life, help them with their decisions. Maybe you're 40 years old, maybe you're 25 years old, maybe you're 55 years old. Um, and you're overwatched or, you, or you, you, you're governing somebody a little bit like that, then, then you need to listen to this message, right? Absolutely. Because it's not just for the person on the Medicare, the actual person on the Medicare, but it could be someone who is overseeing them or overwatching them or maybe just being custodially watching them, right? Just saying, hey, you want to make sure that you're on the right plan. We need to check this out. 
those are the people that I, I, I help with as, as well because at the end of the day, they are the ones in making influencing, whether it's, like I said, a mom or, or, or a daughter or something like that. They're the one making that decision, helping them make the decision, right? And they'll feel so much more comfortable when they know that they can speak to somebody and they understand what they're saying, right? Because right. it's right. important. Uh, there are going to be a lot, a lot, a lot of changes. So please uh, make sure that you either go up on this website that he created for everybody, which is knock, knock, a knock. Dot com, or you can also, they're intertwined, go to abcdmedicare.com and uh, you can also make an appointment right there off of the website to meet with him. You can also call him direct at 602-770-9062 and he would love you to just text him. He gets so many calls, so many people want to talk to right. Peter that he would rather you text him because then he'll get it and he'll uh, be able to get back to you right away. Yeah, that's correct. And you know, if you have a problem with texting, then, then uh, just leave me a message and I'll, I'll get back to right. you right quick. Positive changes. I mean, this is scary thoughts, thinking that everything's going to be so different, but there's good and bad out of everything. Yeah, so part of the pressures of why so many changes, we, we talked about COVID and the, the rebound of people getting out and doing more stuff, the cost. The other part is CMS, which is Medicare, right? Uh, uh, Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services. They're, they're not going to, so plans have star ratings. Right, so five star rating is like a, the, the top level plan. They, they get reimbursed at a higher level because that means they have a higher quality plan and they're taking care of their customers. A two star plan is probably not gonna get any bonus money or reimbursement. It's like anything else. Right, so so what's happening is that reimbursement money to, to the insurance companies is gonna be less. They're not gonna get as, uh, the same amount of money as they've been getting in the past. So in addition to cost pressures of inflation, in addition to you know people utilizing it more, there's going to be less money to cover and go around. Is that a good thing? Well, it's, it's not a good thing, right? No. And so this is where changes and benefits, again, when I told you they were going to right-size Medicare, this is what I was talking about, right? They're going to come back and say, hey, we can't give you the, the, the $7,000 in dental that was on the plan anymore, right? Yeah. We're, we're, going to, we're going to change that, right? We can't give you $400 in vision glasses. We're going to change that. We can't give you hospital stays that were for $125 uh, per day. They're, they're, that's gonna, all, all that stuff's going to change because they're, they're calculating all this in. I'll say, this is how much money we have to fund these plans. And this is how much money, uh, uh, this is what the people are, how the plan are using the plan. And there's going to be changes in these plans. And so you, you may find yourself, or people will find themselves looking at, is this plan still right for me? Right? And that's where I come in to help, help them do that. Right? So that's one of the changes. It's going to be inflationary pressures, overutilization pressures, less money from the government reimbursement money. The other part is the Inflation Reduction Act. So that's an act that passed, I believe, in 2022, which was to reduce cost, the, the cost of drugs. So that's a positive thing, to reduce the cost of drugs to the insurance companies, to, the, to eventually to, to, the, to the final user, which is the Medicare person, uh, beneficiary. And then what I want to talk about is that there's going to be a complete redesign on what they call prescription drug plans. Generally, prescription drugs and major medical, A and B hospitals and, and B for doctors, uh, were, were calculated differently. And um, over the years, the plan has been to get rid of the what they call the donut hole or the gap. I remember so, the donut hole. So this is a positive change. For 2025, there'll be no donut hole, there'll be no gap. You'll have, you'll have uh, your, uh, there'll be three stages. There's, there, were, there was five stages in the, in the past. Now there's only gonna be three. There's gonna be the deductible. There's gonna be the initial coverage, uh, the most you, you pay. And then there's gonna be the, the, the co-pay. And then once you pass the limit, then you go into to, to, uh, what, is, what is now, uh, there is no donut hole, you just go into what they call catastrophic coverage. Mm -hmm. So that's a positive change. All of these changes, the insurance companies have to absorb, right? And so when, when you go to a business, if you came to, my, uh, to the radio station, hey, Carol, uh, we're going to do, uh, we're gonna ask you to do more, but we want you to, to do it for less, mm -hmm. with less money. Right? And everybody would say, well, no, I'm not going to do that. Yeah, so, so that, that's, that's the exactly. right. So what ends up happening is most Medicare plans, Part A and B, Medicare Advantage, and they have a prescription drug plan attached to it, right? So it's a combined uh, plan. Um, those plans are going to have to compensate for the higher cost in drugs. And so they're going to take money away from the A and B side, which is the major medical stuff. And so they're going to have to find a balance to find out what, how do we serve the people in the, in the market, <coughs> excuse me, and, and how do we still be competitive in the market and get people what they need to get the access to care. Only our government will leave it up to us people <coughs> to have to figure it out on our own, right? 
this is why more than ever you need to make sure that you speak to someone like Peter. Well, this is, to be honest with you, now more than ever, this is not when you want to call call center. The, 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 the John Namaths. I can see that. The JJs. You don't want to call these guys. These are guys that are just trying to flip plans. They're just trying to get you to change. They're, they're going, I mean, everything's recorded now. They're supposed to be recorded. You know, you can file a grievance if you're not happy with, with what was said. <coughs> the reality is that this is the time you want to deal with somebody who is in the market that lives in your community, who's going to be held accountable, um, is going to be responsive to you, um, and, and that's going to be able to service you um, Beyond, beyond taking an application, beyond, beyond changing your plan. Hey, Peter, I have a question about my plan. Call me, text me. I'm here. This is what I'm here for. Versus, Happens. versus someone who doesn't live in your area, doesn't understand the dynamics of the medical area, right? Having somebody local here, Correct. having somebody who <coughs> cares about you, definitely. And uh, once you're a client, you're always a client, right? And also yeah. another thing that he does again, he speaks. Spanish and uh, for anyone that is like he said if you are uh, you know helping some of your parents out or someone that is an elderly or senior just any senior and it will be great for you to be able to get connected with him because he can help them understand it better than probably anyone else right. again that phone number to call him direct at 602-770-9062 you can text him there as well uh, and again go up onto these websites he's made them for you so that you can see all the different things he's made it very easy and everything he does not only is it fun but it's also very easy to understand knock knock a knock dot com or you can also go to abcdmedicare.com you can also make an appointment right there with them you uh i don't have much time you have some events too you want to talk about that yeah we're going to have some events we're going to be out local not too many because i expect to be helping people in their homes or on the phone or, or on the on the internet right or through a zoom call or whatever call it is but we're going to have uh, we're going to be at three senior events okay so they're they're, they're senior expos could have some family stuff there right some home stuff there home care but we'll be there all those events are on my calendar on my website so you go there and you can look for them um, one's going to be coming up here in september um and uh, another one's and two of them are going to be in october right and then we're also going to be participating locally here in town uh every wednesday i believe starting on the 29th i think that's a wednesday um or maybe it's the 27th you know but he's this so week, busy he doesn't know what day it is it, it's a wednesday but we're going to be at mid ta pharmacy it's a local compounding pharmacy right at uh 45th 44th Street and Indian School uh, worked really nice with with the head pharmacist there we have a nice relationship so he's asked me to help him with people with all the changes that are happening so we'll be there for two hours every Wednesday that's awesome just to be there we'll have a booth there you can come by and say hi come by and meet me meet Randall the pharmacist and his team there and uh, we're gonna just be there if you have questions maybe I'll answer some questions if you want me to help you with with, with with plant selection we can go through that process as well well I'm gonna start but end what we started with knock knock Who's there? ANOC. ANOC who? You better read your ANOC this year. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Medicare ANOC. You better look at it. You better look at it this year yeah. for sure. So in my in my commercial, if you look at my Instagram, I have, I have a, I made a cartoon figure of myself, right? And I had a punching glove, punching bag, like a glove, boxing glove, knocking you out. Don't get knocked out by this year's ANOC. Listen up, everyone. Yeah. This is important. When you hear that there's going to be some very big changes in Medicare. Not to scare you, there's going to be some positive ones as well, but now more than ever is the best time for you to call and get make sure that you definitely read it, understand it, but know that if you're going to have to change your, your plan, and more than likely it might sound like you're going to, you have the right person here to be able to talk to, and he's here local. That's important. Please talk to someone local. Yeah, absolutely. Go to the website, uh, schedule an appointment. We'll help you review your ANOC. And we're here to help you and serve you guys. So you can go to knockknockanock.com, or you can also go to his website, which is abcdmedicare.com. They intertwine, or you can call him at 602-770-9062 and text him. He can also get you that way as well. Make an appointment and make sure you go see him.